Some senators are now blaming Health Secretary Francisco Duque III for supposedly failing to secure early supplies for vaccine frontrunner Pfizer. Senator Panfilo Laxon has revealed that it was the health chief who dropped the ball and the opportunity of early vaccines went to Singapore instead. The lawmaker says U.S. Ambassador Babe Romualdez and U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo have already been in talk since July. The deal would have given the Philippines 10 million doses of Pfizer's vaccine as early as January next year. But according to Laxon, Duque failed to provide the necessary data agreement for this negotiation. With this, Senator Kiko Pangilinan speculated that a kickback or corruption might be involved in the vaccine deal. He adds that if someone failed to act and led to an injury to the government, a section of the anti-graft law will be applied to them. For Senate President Tito Soto, the president's sentiments on the tall regulatory board on the RFID mess are also appropriate for Duque. Secretary Duque, who was present in a health forum this morning, did not discuss anything related to the controversial vaccine procurement. But in a statement, the health department has maintained that they acted with urgency and in accordance with the protocols of the government. While the agency wanted to expedite the process, the DOH says that there are systems and protocols that should be followed in acquiring the shots. Palace spokesman Harry Roque says the president is seeing no major lapse on the part of Duque based on the president's overall demeanor. The official tells the public to just wait for the health chief's clarification as he has been advised to answer the allegations. The spokesman also notes that the conflicting opinions won't matter because Carlito Galvez Jr. will have the final say as the vaccine star. Uh, kaya nga po, minabuti ni Presidente na uh, advisan si uh, Secretary um, Duque answer the allegations of um, Secretary Roxin. Galvez earlier reported to the President that Pfizer and BioNTech shot is currently among the leading vaccines which could easily be granted an emergency use by the Food and Drug Administration. For News 5, Greg Gregorio, We Are One News.